Hello, this is just a quick video to show you how to import um, external CSV files for backtesting on CALGO, which is the algorithmic trading platform for CTrader. So the idea behind it is that, um, for example, your broker only supplies so much data for doing backtesting, but you can install or you can import and get external data, which is much longer period. So you get a much more qualified sort of backtest results. Um, so if you just go to ClickAlgo website, which you can see on this page, and if you go under CTrader historical market data, this tells you everything you need to know about um, importing market data. You've got from Ducos Copy, you can download, you know, hundreds of uh, instruments of different or different instruments for the data that you want to use. This tells you everything that you need to use it. But this video is just an overview of it because we're going to share how to actually just import the data that you convert to use on CTrader. There's an application here that you can use to convert it as well. So we're, we're supplying free of charge uh, Euro USD. You can get 14 years of backtest data. And I'll show you in a minute with CTrader, with uh, my broker I'm using at the moment, which is FX Pro, um, there's only something like six years or five or six years of um, historical data to test on Euro dollar. So this is more than double the amount of data that you can use. Also, uh, you can download the DAX file, which also is um, the Germany 30. And that, that's got uh, nearly four years of historical data. Uh, and on my platform, it only covers 11 months. So 11 months isn't a very long time to backtest your strategies. Uh, four years is much better. OK, so these two you can just download for free. They're just an example. So I'm going to show you, uh, let's just drag this server across. I'm going to show you how you would actually import backtest data to be used. So currently, this is using the ClickAlgo Switchback Forex robot. And it's got um, a one minute time frame. And it's showing you that on a backtest with the current data, if you click on this button up here, you can see data one minute bar from server, open prices. It's going from 2011 to 2017, which is like five, uh, six years or whatever. So it's not a lot of data. So I'm going I'm to import the 14 years worth of data. So you'd have a lot of data to do it. So I've already got the file that I've downloaded from that website and I've put it on my hard drive. You just select from data, you select one minute bars in CSV file open prices. OK, so this is your CSV file that we're going to import into CTrader. Now it's already actually, I've already selected it here previously, so it's already remembered it. But if I click on that button there, you then find the file that you want to use. In, in this case, it's this one, one minute bid prices, 2014 to 2017. So if I click on that button there, now you can see that it's gone from 2011 to 2017. But then if I drag this slider all the way to the left, it's going from 1st of the 1st, 2004 to the 20th of the 1st, 2017. That's the last time that I, I downloaded the data. So this is um, a whole range of data that you can backtest. So when you run it, you'll be able to see uh, the data that's in there. But this um, example video was just to show you, or demonstration, sorry, just to show you how to import CSV, an external CSV file. That's it. That's all you need to do. And if you want to go back to your uh, broker, broker, you just go back to one minute prices again, and it comes up on there. Okay.